Hey guys, Dr. Sean Hashmi here with the Kaiser Permanente Woodland Hills. I'm a practicing nephrologist. I've uh, been doing so for several years. Today I wanted to talk to you about how to treat a kidney stone. And kidney stones are an interesting thing. They're one of the most painful experiences that you will ever have. And trust me, I don't wish that upon anybody. So now let's say you've been diagnosed with a kidney stone. How do you go about treating it? Well, the first question you want to ask your doctor is, how big is the kidney stone? This matters greatly because if it's less than or about equal to 4 millimeters, chances are it can pass by itself. All you got to do is drink a lot more water and that will help to pass it. If it's greater than 4 millimeters, as it gets larger in size, the chances of it passing by itself go down more and more. Greater than 10 millimeters, chances are it's probably not going to pass by itself. So what are the treatment options that your doctor might talk about? Well, there's a couple. We have shockwave lithotripsy, which is basically focusing high energy towards the stone, goes through the skin and impacts the stone, breaks up the stone. Another option is using a ureteroscope and going in and actually pulling the stone out. Sometimes they'll break it apart. One of the latest advances we have is using lasers to actually go in, break the stone apart, and then pulling it out. But those are your general options when it comes to treating stones that are bigger. Now, sometimes they may have to actually do open surgery where the stone is really large, such as can be seen in staghorn stones, which are very large stones. But for your own information, the things you can do is drink a lot more water. That will help facilitate passage if the stone is small enough where it can pass by itself. Just keep in mind though, you got to use a strainer because knowing the composition of the stone is extremely important. If we know what the type of stone is, we can actually help you to prevent having recurrent stones. That's going to be a topic for another video, but I wanted to make sure you guys are aware. So, how to treat a kidney stone? Increase hydration, surgical techniques including using lasers, using shockwave lithotripsy, or sometimes having to open up and go in and take the stone out. Other things that can help in terms of stones can be medications such as Flomax or Tamulosin that can actually facilitate the passage of the stone. Hopefully this information was helpful to you guys. This is Dr. Sean Hashmi uh, with Woodland Hills Kaiser and uh, we were talking today about how to treat a kidney stone. Thank you.